Hey everybody, Old School American here. It's Sunday, January 12th, 2011. And I think I'm going to take a cruise down to the Gila River. Right out in front of Phoenix International Raceway. I'm going to go down there and take some pictures and shoot some video with my new camera here. So, here's what I'm going to take with me. Got my bug out bag there. Right there, my bug out bag. That's my gas mask. That's my 9mm carbine. Got me a styrofoam cooler here with a gallon of water in it. Going to get some ice for it. And we're probably going to check this gas price. Here we go. First gas price check is in El Mirage, Arizona. And you can see that it's $3.55 a gallon at the Shell Station. Okay, I'm between El Mirage and Glendale, Arizona right now. Outstanding in the middle of these fields. Actually right over there. Is Luke Air Force Base. See those mountains right back there? Phoenix International Raceway is straight back up against the mountains there. Just about to the middle of the frame there. That's where we're going. And it's a beautiful day. No chemtrails. There's the only clouds right there. Other than that, it's a picture perfect sky. A beautiful day. It's supposed to be 102 degrees today. If it gets too hot, I might have to find myself a private spot down at the river and uh, take myself a dip. Okay, here we are on the corner of Dysart and Glendale. In Glendale, Arizona, on the far west side. And we are at Circle K. Or gas. It's 353 for regular. Per gallon. There's a shell station right over there. We're going to go right by that in a minute. We'll get the price there. Oh no, here's the price right over here. $3.55 a gallon at the shell station. So it looks like $3.55. $3.53 has been the lowest I've seen so far. Okay. I came here to the Circle K actually to get some ice. But they don't take debit cards today because something's wrong. Here's one of my favorite spots. I haven't been here in a few years. They got it all butchered up. That barrier wasn't there. All this crap here. Didn't look like this either. Looks like they might be trying to rebuild this road somewhat. At least enough for people to come down here and do a little fishing. Yep, I've caught many a fish right here. Many right around that little island right there. It's beautiful right here. That barrier right there sucks up. So. 
Look at that beautiful lake. Walked all along this bank right here. Many fish, caught many fish. Walked all throughout here too. Say it's only four and a half feet deep anywhere in this most parts of this river. In this section anyhow. Walking over to the east side of the road here. So you got some fishermen over there too. We had a fire here. I think it was like last year. You can see all the See where these this foliage has been burnt, hasn't grown back yet. It looks like they've mowed down a bunch of it over there. I've walked all throughout this section over here too. Caught lots of fish like 30 or 40 fish in a couple hours. Nice size. Large mouth bass. There's lots of tilapia in here. They get pretty big too, a couple pounds, some of them. And there's a lot of bluegill. You can catch bluegill all day long. Just dropping a darn hook right over this section right here. You just drop a hook down there. They'll start hitting on it. So now everybody knows where my fishing hole is. So I'm gonna get my butt back to the car and get the heck out of here. It just keeps on getting hotter. Hope you all enjoyed my fishing hole. Here we are at Avondale. Avondale Road and McDowell Road. At the Circle K, it's 359 for going again. Okay, folks, we're at 91st Avenue and Olive in West Glendale, Arizona. We're at the QT. We're going a regular, it's 353. Right across the street, we have a Chevron station. There at 355. Okay, everybody, we're kind of on uh, another Circle K gas station. That looks like 353 a gallon. That's on Olive and 95th in Peoria, Arizona. By the way, the last two gas stations were in Peoria, not West Glendale. It's so real close to where the two cities meet. Another QT here on Agofuya Ranch Freeway. And Olive, 351, the lowest yet. Three, last game.